what's up everybody back here with another video it's been a while since i've seen you guys um back here from squared Cir squared circle expo 2 uh big meet and greet today in indianapolis indiana um first and foremost thumbs up on it again uh just as good as last year's if not better to be honest with you uh, met a lot of people up there. I don't really have any complaints. Um, one complaint I may, you know, I'm not, I understand it, but like the Steiner brothers, I know they just went in the Hall of Fame, um, but I was going to get a poster signed uh, by both of them, and they wanted 90 a piece. Now, y'all let me know if y'all think that's too much. I, I didn't, I, you know, I passed on that. Uh, but I get it. I mean, they just went in the Hall of Fame. Um, but if you read the title, you know who we met today. Uh, we met Ron Simmons, uh, Ricky Steamboat, Million Dollar Man, Sabu, uh, Road Dog, Steiners, uh, Blue Meanie. Rip Rogers and Flash Flanagan, some old OVW guys, JBL. Um, so yeah, we met a lot of dudes today. Um, so let's get right into the video here. Get out the way. Right into the video here of what we're here for, uh, and that's autographs. And as always, I usually start the video off with the posters, uh, and that's what we're gonna do again. Um, first poster up is the Great American Bash 1990. I've showed this one to you last year when I got Luger and Arn to sign. Uh, this was the poster I was going to get the Steiners on. Just I just didn't have the money today for it. Um, but I got that signed by Ron Simmons right there. Uh, he was with Doom on this event. I got that in turquoise paint. Just trying to switch it up a little bit. As you can see there, sorry about the light. Get close. It's a Ron Simmons. So you can see right there in blue. Next poster. Um, these two posters I'll be getting signed as, again next week. Um, we have the first WrestleMania poster. Uh, I showed you this one when I did my Hogan autographs. Uh, we got Ricky Steamboat to sign this one. Not a lot of guys alive to even get this sign. There you go, right there, in light green. Not a lot of guys left alive to even get this thing signed. Uh, Bob Orton will be at the event that I'm at next Saturday, uh, and I'll probably get him to sign this as well. But pretty good looking signature by Ricky Steamboat. Um, I did get a couple cards signed by him as well. Uh, we'll do cards after we do posters, um, but. Cool, man. WrestleMania 6. Uh, we got this poster. We'll be getting this inked up by a few people next week. Um, here, as you can see, uh, we got Ted DiBiase. It's autograph on here. Uh, trying to get... I also have Hogan and demolition on here as well as you see but there's ted DiBiase right above warrior um nice looking piece we're gonna get some more people to sign this next week i can't wait that's all the posters i took i didn't take a ton of posters um, but those are the three i got all the posters i wanted signed uh the only like the the steiners you know what i'm saying i wanted but i couldn't uh, it's cool it is what it is Let's go ahead and knock out the cards that we got today. We got we got a Rick Steiner, old WCW card. We got a Scott, uh, Scott Steiner, Steiner Brothers card. Got a couple of Ron. I got a I got a bunch of shit signed by Ron Simmons today. His line wasn't too long, and I had extra. You know, cash to kill because I could get that poster signed. But uh, here's a Ron Simmons. We 
There's another Ron Simmons. It's my last Ron Simmons card of the day from Doom. And shout out to Norm Lilly and Norm Productions. They always have the best guests for the best prices, and he's a class act. Shout out to him if he's watching this video or anybody that knows him. Um, we got some rookie Steamboat cards signed. We got this Topps Heritage. This one is actually a sticker. Ricky Steamboat. Um, and then the last two cards, we have a Lex Luger. That in blue paint, turquoise. And then we have a Ted DiBiase. So those are the cards uh, that I got signed today. Like I said, I got a little bit. This is the most cards I've ever got an autograph signed. Um, but, you know, I bought all of these cards with other things. And I really, you know, you can get these cards signed for half price if you know what you're doing. I mean, I've been doing this shit for 15 years. All right, next up. Let's go to some DVD covers that we got inked up here. Uh, this is the EC. This is an insert because the front is full of the ECW DVD. I got this signed by Blue Meanie. He's right there. Hard to see. Um, we got this is a special show to me. I always dug it. Um, you know, my senior year of high school, we went or whatever. OVW Christmas Chaos. Um, I got this one signed by Rip Rogers and Flash Flanagan. You can see right there, Flash Flanagan, Rip Roberts, Rogers. I was always a fan of his. Um, first professional wrestler I ever met was Rip Rogers in a Winn-Dixie in like 1997. The dude had his full gear on. No bullshit. And he was... Didn't break kayfabe, <laughs> so if you get what my drift. All right, we have timeline history of ECW in 1997. We have Sabu. I've been trying to get all these signed. Then we have timeline history of WWE 1993. We have Alex Luger. And that's all the DVD covers that I got. This convention, uh, it can get a little pricey, so you got to be careful, but it's still not expensive as a lot of places. All right. The 50 book. Y'all remember this. We're almost done with this bad boy. Um, today, we added JBL and the Road Dog. Um see it there's the road dog down there in the corner and then we have jbl is right there so like i said this book is almost full i got a couple more signatures to get on this next week and this book page will be full so we're good sorry sorry about that i was just looking at something all right, next up, we'll go ahead and jump into the figures we got signed today. We got three figures signed today. First off, we have Sabu. This is a classic superstars. We went with the white paint on this one. Love the paint pens. Classic superstars. Uh, ain't it about time like we come out with the Mattel come out with like an ECW line of some sort? Just saying. I hardly ever get the classic signed anymore, but I've had that one for a while, so I figured I'd go ahead and sign, get it signed. Next up, we have the Road Dog, Jesse James. Got that one in the light green paint. As you can see, it's a Suck It Road Dog DX. Cool stuff. He's the main reason I went, to be honest with you. Um... Uh, he's the what sold me the ticket. Road Dogs what got me there. Um, so it was it was it was a blast meeting him. He was cool as hell. Not much from what I saw. wasn't much difference from him and the character, bro. 
But uh, he was a cool dude. Much respect to him. I kind of felt bad because I didn't have anything for Billy Gunn this time, but I had met him so many times before. And then our last figure of the day, we have the Hall of Champions, Ron Simmons. We got this signed in uh, Turquoise, Ron Simmons, 1992, World Champion, Hall of Fame, 2012. I think it looks excellent. And these these things come in so much so handy when they you get the autographs, man. They really do. But that's the figures we got signed today. Like I said, we got Ron Simmons, we got Road Dog, and we got Sapu. The ones we got today. So cool deal. Sorry that this video is running so long, guys. I just had a lot. Um, next up, we'll finish this video up with eight by tens and magazines. This first 8x10 that we got here um, is by Farouk. Hold on one second. Uh, I left one of the items over here. I see it now. Give me one second. I'm coming, y'all. I'm coming. Hold on. There it is. All right, I'm back. The other eight by ten. Blue mini. I uh, got this one today as well. Almost forgot that one. Up next, the other eight by ten that we have: the New Age Outlaws. Got that finished. This we've seen this one on my wall. Something about Billy Gunn a long time ago. But this, like I said, Road Dogs why I went. All right, WWF Magazine, January of 1988. We got it signed by Ted DiBiase. I don't have any more magazines for DiBiase to sign, but it looks good in silver. And then our last item, before I let you guys go, we have Royal Rumble 1989, the Royal Rumble where DiBiase bought his number. I got him a sign right there. Above Demolition Axe. So yeah, man, them's the, those are the autographs um, for today uh, from Squared Circle Expo, Indianapolis. Big thumbs up. Much love. Well ran. Um, the only complaint I had was the Steiner Brothers prices on that poster. But other than that, top notch. Excellent. Uh, shout out to Ed. He's got it going on there. Uh, and I'll be there for everyone as long as they continue to be like this. Sorry that video ran long. But uh, if you didn't see yesterday, I went to the Taco Meet and Greet. Go check that video out. Give this one a thumbs up and be ready for next week uh, when I come back from Heroes and Legends. I'm out, y'all. Peace.